rap, yo. We feature all local, independent, underground artists. artists. When I say local, I just mean local. Like the ones that live next door to you that you ain't heard yet. Feel me? Feel me? Yeah, the slept on motherfuckers. The overlooked ass dudes. The underrated. The ones that's finna be legends, son. You know? Without too much more fucking talking. It's a rap, yo. What's happening, family? We're back with another reaction. Today we got the homies. J Law Roman 365 collabed on a song a uh, track for J Law's new album coming up. I'm not sure what it's called. Let's see. I forget what it's called. Uh it doesn't say. Doesn't it say? Bro, I swear YouTube be taking likes away. There were six earlier, and now it's back down to three. Shaking my head, trying to keep us low men down. Yeah. Yeah, it took views away from that from that uh getting played video, Roman. Had uh one day it had five sixty seven. And it's back down to in, in the five twenties now. So I don't know what that's all about. I think people re replay songs and uh what happens is YouTube's algorithm don't catch that it's from the same IP address, you know, and then when it catches up, we see the mistake, you know, so we see the first mistake where they added the views from, mul from multiple views from the same account, and then we see the correction a few days later, which is kind of bullshit to me, but it's whatever, so this is the homie J-Law, Roman365, this joint's called The Raven, animated music video, I believe Roman made the video. I don't know though. This doesn't really look like Roman's artwork. I don't know. We'll see what happens. You ready, fam? Yo, before we get started, if you're not sub to the channel yet, please do me that solid. Slide the screen up. Tap that sub button. Three piece that notification bell. Get that thing to ringing. Feel me? You want to get notified? Let's go. Hold on, wait, 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 just missed something really important here. Don't want to do that. The Raven. The meaning behind the Raven is that you should let go. You cannot hold on to everything you love forever. That's true. But, uh... I don't know, man. Is that... Because uh, the Raven, isn't that a Edgar Allan Poe story? I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not actually sure what the uh, the moral lesson behind that story is. I'll have to... You know what? That's a good story, too. I think it's called The Raven. I'm going to I'm gonna have to read that again. Oh, I missed more? I, mi I missed more. Hold on. My bad. Oh, damn. Sorry about that, fam. Trying to. It will only bring you pain and suffering if you try to. So if you try to hold on to the things that you love forever, it'll only bring you pain and suffering. Most artists know the purpose and true meaning of hip hop. I'm not sure how this ties into that, but. Due to back. Oh, due to backlash, the fear of unpopularity and low record sales, they sacrifice their love, knowledge, and respect for hip hop. Only to please the fans with the nonsense they all desire.
I shall never do that. Quaff the raven nevermore. Yeah, I believe that is a... Uh, it's either a Edgar Allan Poe story or... And I'm not sure, man. Could be like Hitchcock or something. I'm, I can't remember. I think it's Poe, though. That intro is hella fucking long, bro. Oh, that... That was the song cover art. And life we lose something. Nobody loses nothing. All lives will collide with the truth. No remorse. In our lives, we all lose something. Hold on. And life we lose something. Nobody loses nothing. All lives. Nobody loses nothing. Will collide with the truth, no remorse. Take All lives will collide with the truth, no remorse. I love Jay's sound, like I don't know man. It's something about you know his accent and everything, the deepness of his voice and shit just works so well on a beat with a heavy ass bass line. A sip of this special mix that can fix Wrap the people all around me and prepare for what is next I reminisce about a good sin I didn't deserve it But who am I to argue with the plan God gives I'm Chris and Rich to lift the sense of broken wrist The cause of it, the game is clinching over with This is a problem I can't fix Pardon me, I'm Ah, uh, hold on, man, hold on I'm in prepare for what is next I reminisce about a good sin I didn't deserve it But who am I to argue with the plan God gives I'm Chris and Rich to lift the sense of broken wrist The cause of Crest it wrench to fix the future broken wrists broken wrists because uh, you know it'd be hard it'd be hard to sometimes you know turn a rusty bolt on something be mad hard I'm a mechanic so I know this feeling all too well like I've broken my hands by just trying to get a bolt free so they fix the future it's gonna be hard it's gonna be hard to fix the future even with this big ass crescent wrench you know the you the crescent wrench being you know what you got to do to change you know what i'm saying the future you know but it's going to be hard it's going to be tough in, in our lives we all lose something we all nobody loses nothing Ooh, jay coming with the ooh. Fit the game is clinching over with This is a problem I can't fix Pardon me, I'm thinking loud man. My mind really shouts It's like a million of my fans Screaming all throughout the crowd Man, I'm thinking like an orphan When it comes to making music Cause the people were confused Way before they listen to it So confused Feeling like an orphan way before the... <sighs> Come on Okay, my mind really shouts It's like a million of my fans Screaming all throughout the crowd Man, I'm thinking My mind really shouts It's like a million of my fans Screaming all throughout the crowd I like that. Like an orphan when it comes to making music cause the people were confused way before they listen to it. So I'm feeling like an orphan when it comes to making music cause the people were confused way. It's like a million of my fans screaming all throughout the crowd. Man, I'm thinking like an orphan when it comes to making music cause the people were confused way before they listen to it. So confused about the fact they were confused way before they listened to it. My therapy so overdue. I'll give you honest music, but I hate to hear the truth. I'm in the mood to dis I give you honest music, but I hate to hear the truth. Prove of every fool being rude. Quote the raven nevermore as I begin to do a chore. Rhyme and reason fees all the anger that my mind keeps. And retaliation is the cause from the beast. Well, the seed with the thoughts I proceed to be your boss. Like I say once before, my mind shouts when it talks. I could be your role model for the clinically insane. Just strap a jacket on me while I'm screaming who's to blame. I could be a role model for the clinically insane. Just strap a jacket on me. Why can't I get through a bar? Why can't I get through a bar? Cause from the beast will proceed with the thoughts. I proceed to be your boss. Like I say, once before my mind shouts when it talks. I could be your role model for the clinically insane. Just strap a jacket on me while I'm screaming who's to blame. Strap a jacket on me while I'm screaming who's to blame. Yes, mama raised a perfect individual, but only perfect at mistakes. Quote the raven nevermore. Ooh, yes, mama raised a perfect individual, but only perfect at mistakes. Quote the raven nevermore. Woo hoo hoo. Alright, Jay, man, I'm feeling the flow too. Doing your thing, Brody. 
story of an artist, how the job really is. They get the fans what they want, but never need strictly this. But this, I won't persist, respect myself. Give the fans what they want, but I never mean strictly, but never mean strictly biz. Giving the fans what they want, so I'm not really, you know. Come on. I'm not really giving, I'm not really giving my true hip hop, my true love to hip hop, my true knowledge of everything. You know, I'm never meaning strictly business. You know, I'm just giving them what they want sometimes. We'll take a hit. But honest music is a mission. Quote the Raven with this. You know the story of an artist, how the job really is. They get the fans what they want, but never need strictly this. But this I won't persist. Respect yourself, we'll take a hit. But honest music yeah, is a sir. mission. Quote the Raven with this. I'm like that so raven with a blank stare or a brand from game. I'm like that so raven with a blank stare. Raven? That's the uh, uh that's the uh, Raven Simone. That's the chick from the Cos. That's the little girl from the Cosby Show. Plus, she had her own show and a cartoon. Well, she had a cartoon when I was little. I don't know if Roman ever seen that, but that was a pretty cool cartoon too. The drums, but my visions ain't clear. I might have to go a wall with my partner J Law. Could we kill this shit? On I'm gonna have to go a wall with my partner J Law. A a wall means um uh absence without leave like so like you wasn't <laughs> like you wasn't uh given the right to leave like in the military and shit this wanted poster wanted for 500 bucks uh reward for the arrest and detention I don't fucking know what that says. Walter White. Trash, but we break off. Call me Ray Lewis, cause I got away with murder. Claim I didn't. Call me Ray Lewis, cause I got away with murder. Do it, don't believe all that you heard, bro. This Raven is a grown man, not a teen titan. Need to get with the. This Raven's a grown man, not a teen titan. Ooh. Uh. Teen Titans got the. Uh, one of the heroes is Raven. Um, he said, I'm a grown man, not a teen titan, like these little kids trying to, you know, take, take over, they, you know, take over the rap game with a nonsense, you know, the, the, the garbage content and shit. Program, cause I've been inviting those who say they amazing to step up to the plate. But it's by the way of Raven, so they might just get it late. I'm an MVP running things like Lamar Jackson. If you envy me, then come to me, cause I want all the action. There is a wrestler named Raven. I'm more like that man. Hardcore. There's a wrestler named Raven. I'm more like that man. Raven. Uh. I'm not sure where Raven's from. I'm in the service from the WWE or ECW, but he's a hardcore. Wrestler, he like he, I've seen him in a lot of hardcore matches, um, and that's probably when WWE and ECW were doing a lot of things together. So I'm not sure if Raven from WCW, ECW, or WWE, but definitely he's definitely a hardcore fucking wrestler. Misbehaving when I hit with a trash can. Hey, diddle diddle, Ray Rice up the middle, smack. I'm be misbehaving when I get with hit with a trash can. I feel like he's talking about when he hears this trash music, you know, I, I get to misbehaving when I get hit with a trash can. Down the hope to the flow, throwing bows like I'm scared of halftime of the Super Bowl, I'll knock your lights out to affect the final score, then retire you on out. Gone. <sighs> like the Super Bowl, I'll knock your lights out. Like uh, there was a blackout. I'm not sure which. This is Super Bowl 37. Lights went out. But he said when they come back and when they come back it's on it's just to affect the the final score. Wow. I don't really know much about that. I might have to I might have to check that out. With the wind, spread my wings and fly Off into the sunset so my legacy won't die From New York down to Texas Our messages will travel Hopefully it is impressive From New York down to Texas Our messages will travel Jay from New York, I believe Well, he, I'm not sure if he lives in New York But he's from New York 
Roma's from Texas. So he's like, from New York down to Texas, we're gonna carry this message. All right. And it leaves you niggas baffled. There's an acronym for rap, it stands for rhythm and poetry. So it is a The acronym for rap? Never, I've never addressed that. And uh, it, that's what it is, rhythm and poetry. <laughs> and that's something these, uh, these young dudes don't understand. These dudes out here pandering to, to the masses, they don't really understand. You know, the mumble rappers. And when we say mumble rappers, we're not talking about rappers that just mumble and you can't understand them. Mumble rappers are rappers that talk about nothing. Like, uh, Lil Pump is a decent rapper, right? But what's he, what's he, what's he talk about? Nothing, you know? There's no poetry involved, you know? It's just like repeating a lot of words over and over again and being, you know, harmonic on a beat. You know what I'm saying? Like, so you auto-tune your shit up, jump on a beat, say a bunch of shit over and over again. Especially if it's something like, you know, a product or, 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 or a drug or something. You just say that shit over and over again and everybody eats it up. Especially if it sounds good, you know? So a lot of mumble songs is a song that talks about nothing. But it could sound good, you know? And that's what, that's what makes it sell, you know? I don't get it. Rhythm and poetry, man. That's what rap's all about. Well, he just solidified it. It's uh, the Raven, you know. This the story. It's the Edgar Allan Poe and me. I'm really good. Get the fans what they want, but never need strictly this. But this I won't persist. Strike the sense, we'll take a hit. But honest music is a mission. Quote the Raven with this. You know the story of the North and South. The job really good. Get the fans what they want, but never need strictly this. But this I won't persist. Strike the sense, we'll take a hit. But honest music is a mission. Quote the Raven with this. Sounds like he's saying, quote the raven with this. <coughs> it's just his accent and shit. We all say shit a little bit differently, but I kept feeling like he was saying, quote the raven. You know? Um, this was, this was fucking dope, man. That video was dope. Uh, I'm having a hard time catching bars. Because I don't feel good, man. I don't... But, uh, you get the point, man. You know what I'm saying? Um, don't ever, don't, 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 um, I mean, it's weird. The analogy, man, it's like you have to give up things you love. You can't hold on to them forever. But he's saying, like, don't give up your love, the love and the respect and the knowledge for hip-hop. You know what I'm saying? Just to appease the masses, you know, be you and shit. So... You're saying to hold on to that love, but we shouldn't try to hold on to that love. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, fam. Catch me in the comments section and piece me up with that three piece if I'm wrong. You know what I'm saying? But all in all, this was dope, man. Um, Roman's always got some references. His bars always contain references to shit. And uh, if you think about it, like they, it always makes sense. But like right now, I'm having a hard time putting things together and the football I don't watch a lot of football I mean I did hear about the blackout and the, the Super Bowl but I didn't he said something about just to affect the final score you know so he's like I'm gonna knock your lights out you know like the like the Super Bowl I'm gonna knock your lights out but it's only to affect the final score you know it's like knock some sense into you you know what I'm saying knock some sense into the to, to the people listening and get them to understand you know the true the true art and the true what hip hop's all about, what rap's all about, you know. Uh, me and the God was talking about that shit the other day. Um, how um, you know the hip hop culture has been watered down a lot by rap music today, you know, being that it's tied directly into big businesses and stuff like that, and um, you know, merchandising and. It's really about big flexes, who's got the fanciest cars, you know, drugs, um, shit like that. And, and just about every popular music video, you see money being thrown around, bottles being popped. And feel like the hip-hop culture and what it's really about has been watered down by that, you know, with today's music. And so hip-hop and rap has become a separate entity, you know, rap. But you got artists that are still out here 
that still respect the culture and they still tell a story, you know what I'm saying? They, they, um, and give a message, you know what I'm saying? Like they, like it was meant to be, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, so I don't know, man, the whole, you gotta get, you, you can't hold on to things you love because it's gonna put you, you know, through a lot of pain and a lot of suffering and shit. But then the, the message in here is to not give up, you know, not give up your love for, for hip hop and don't sacrifice that love. Don't sacrifice that just for record sales and, you know, for fans and, and clicks and views and shit. To me, that's what I took from this. You know, I wasn't catching like a lot of the bars and, you know, breaking it down in depth. Like, that's what I took from what I heard, you know pretty dope that they used the raven as the concept though you know finally finally got the two homies man together on a track man that's that's dope man i hope they do more work in the future together i feel like their sounds their sounds combine really really nice and uh i don't know you know if Jay did the work mixing it up what whatever but he doesn't never Never write us a description and tell us about the track. So we just gotta, you know, whatever. The track was clean, so the um, you know, production on that was dope. Um, I don't know. I'm sure this thing is gonna catch as soon as we upload this. Exmge is gonna slap me with a motherfucking claim. But that's all right, man. That's all right. Uh, you know, can't get around it, man. I don't know. Um, hopefully, maybe I paused enough for him to not fuck with me. I don't know. We had, like, there's a couple hours to say every single thing that I react to gets claimed and shit. And I, like, snapped about it the other day. And, uh, they went to their company and they getting that content ID claim shit taken off me so that I could react to their shit without getting fucking hit every, th every single time. You know? So, I don't know. But this was dope, man. I'm glad the homies did, got got a chance to work together and, you know, put both their styles together and show us that. Yo, dope. Roman's doing his thing with these videos, too, man. Uh, uh, I don't know what that fucking intro is all about, man. Like I said, I don't really feel like it, um, it ties in with the message of the song, you know, too much. But... I don't know. I haven't read the story either, so... But the whole message of, uh... You have to let go of shit. You know? We all lose something. I don't know, man. I, I, I don't know, man. I don't know. But... All in all, it was dope. Real clean. Um... I fucking love Roman's flow. And, uh, Jay's got this accent that... That just it's got the sound man it's like that deep and it you know i don't know man it's like it's hard to it's hard to describe it sometimes man i don't know but yo family i'm gonna drop the links to the homies you know how we do it go and grab them things I show the homies some love drop them likes comments grab them subs i don't know what you thought i know i sent you check out my links down there it's a whole bunch of links you can do your thing with those man handle them things to the next one. It's a wrap, yo. Peace. Oops.